All right, welcome to episode 12 of the Daily Level Up Show. I am your host, Roosevelt Cooper, and this show tracks my journey as a gamer dad entrepreneur. What is a gamer dad entrepreneur? A gamer dad entrepreneur, first of all, is a gamer, someone who enjoys playing games, such as video games, board games, tabletop role-playing games, and fantasy sports. Dad, someone who is a father of one or more children. An entrepreneur, someone who builds businesses or solves problems at a profit. So that's basically what this show is about. It tracks my journey as a gamer dad entrepreneur. And today, I wanted to talk about the topic Are gamer dad entrepreneurs corny? Are gamer dad entrepreneurs corny? So if you follow pop culture, you might see that one of the hot topics of discussion is the actor Michael um, B. Jordan. Michael B. Jordan is one of the top actors in Hollywood right now. He has a brand new movie coming out called Creed 3 where he is basically a spinoff of the original Rocky franchise and where basically Creed is the son of Rocky's original nemesis turned friend, Apollo. So it's a spinoff of that franchise and this is actually Michael B. Jordan's directorial debut, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. This is the first uh, movie that he's actually not just acted in, but played, but is actually the director of the movie. So he's doing a lot of interviews right now to promote the movie. And interestingly enough, he was in a situation where a young lady was interviewing him. And it turns out that the young lady that was interviewing him, he actually went to high school with. And he remembered her and she remembered him from high school. And... So when she when she started asking him questions, um, he was he was like, she, and she she and she mentioned the fact that they went to high school together. He was like, yeah, I was the corny guy. That's what y'all said, right? Or something to that effect. So basically, he used to get made fun of in high school and called corny because first of all, his name was Michael Jordan, and we all know that. There's a Michael Jordan from basketball who was like the most famous basketball player that ever lived to the point where he hasn't played in decades and his sneakers are still the number one sneaker brand in the world today. So he was, so he had the same name, so they made fun of, the, of him for that. And then I also found out that back then he used to walk around with copies of his headshot. So he used to walk around, you know, if you're familiar with acting and things of that nature, actors, they have headshots that they have to submit when they are applying or, or, or trying out for a particular role. They have to submit their headshots. Well, in high school, he used to walk around with copies of his headshot. And he went to high school, I believe, in Newark, New Jersey, and they made fun of him because of that. He was called corny. So that's where that remark is. <laughs> So when I saw that, it got me to thinking about Gamer Dad Entrepreneurs and some of the things that I've heard. Um, I've heard some people, um, particularly women, call men who play games corny. So the question is, are Gamer Dad Entrepreneurs corny? Well, we take a look at Michael B. Jordan. He got the last laugh because now he's the biggest star in Hollywood. He's having a whole lot of success. His de- his directorial debut is coming up um, when this movie gets released. I think this month actually it might might even be getting released today. Um, so he got the laugh, and he's making millions and millions of dollars. So he got the last laugh. So are gamer dad entrepreneurs corny? No, gamer dad entrepreneurs are not corny. We are men who enjoy playing our games. Whether it is video games, boy games, tabletop role-playing games, fantasy sports, we enjoy spending time with our family, and we also enjoy building our businesses. 
and some of the most successful business owners on the planet are gamers. Take Elon Musk, for example. Regardless of how you feel about him personally as an individual, you cannot deny the fact that he has created one of the most successful companies in the world, Tesla. And guess what? Elon Musk is a gamer, and he is a dad as well. Um, take Mark Zuckerberg from Facebook. Um, regardless of how you feel about Mark personally as an individual, you can't deny the fact that Facebook is a very successful enterprise. And Mark Zuckerberg is a gamer, and I believe he's a dad as well, if I'm not mistaken. So some of the most successful entrepreneurs in the world are gamer dad entrepreneurs. So no, gamer dad entrepreneurs are not corny. Don't let anyone try to minimize you because you enjoy gaming, you enjoy being a father, and you enjoy being an entrepreneur. Those people who make fun of you because of your hobbies and interests, they are the corny ones. They're just jealous because they don't have something that gives them the joy that our hobby gives us. So because of that, they take their jealousy out on you and try to call you corny because of what it is that you like. That's one reason why they do it. Sometimes another reason why they do it is maybe they were hurt in the past by someone who may have been a gamer. Maybe that person didn't have their priorities straight. Maybe they might have even suffered from gaming addiction and that person was hurt by them. But even still, that does not give them an excuse to take their negative experiences out on you. So are gamer dad entrepreneurs corny? No. Gamer dad entrepreneurs are not corny. As a matter of fact, gamer dad entrepreneurs, we rule the world.